Goat meat is considered among the most delicious and healthy meat available, but it is difficult to find on local shelves. This is due to its high demand in South Africa, especially the KwaZulu-Natal province market, where it is used mostly for traditional purposes. That remains the extent of Namibia's foreign market in goat meat. During a goat farmer's information sharing session in Venduk, the need was expressed to explore other neighboring countries. The market is still there. The market is there for the entry-level animals in our studs to be sold off for realistic values, for realistic quality in those markets. These countries still farm with indigenous goats, whereas Namibia uses stud breeders. Borders stress the need to multiply goat stock in the country. We have to find a model as to say we need the breeding stock in this country as to increase our own herd from 500,000 up to 1.5 million or 1 million. But the challenge is we have drought conditions, we have financial conditions, everything. It's, it remains a challenge. So at the end of the day, each individual has to take this information, what we can provide, and see how we can leverage from it and how we can contribute towards it. But there is need for closer cooperation between Namibia and Zimbabwean goat farmers to share the best genetic materials. The way forward is linkages between our association and your association and working together for the promotion, uh, commercialization and expansion of boar goats, Kalahar raids, savannah and other improved breeds. There are also potential markets in non-SADC member states such as Uganda, Kenya up to Ghana where they mostly farm with ancient breeds of goats. Namibia started about 100 years ago to transform its breed of goats to reach the current high level of quality goat it is revered for with its own genetics. The Kalahari Reds, Savannah and the Bull Goat are Namibia's top goat breeds with the south of the country considered the leader in terms of goat population. Jeff Tashihomino, NBC News, Venduk.